So a typical day for me is 6 a.m. get up, something like that, 6.30. And my husband, who is amazing, is busy making the lunches for the children. And then I'm busy preparing the, the things that they need for school. We get ready for school. And then I drop my son at 8.30. We go across Tokyo in the train um, to his school. And then after that, after I've dropped him off, I need time to get into my entrepreneur mindset and maybe have coffee or tea and plan my day ahead. And I plan with my goals in mind of what I want to achieve that day. So I head to my studio, which is in Shimokitazawa in Tokyo, and I start my work in my studio, which is always a mess with kimono everywhere. fabric scraps on the floor and jewelry parts everywhere but it's my mess and it's really fun and it's an exciting place to be and I make anything from 10 to 20 to 30 pieces of jewelry in one day but depending on which design I'm making on the day and the difficulty level of it around about 2 30 or 3 o'clock I then go and pick my son up again and then I make the the dinner, the bath, the bedtime, and we do the the second shift. And then in the evening, I might work again on my business. So I might do some social media work, or I might write a blog, or I might make some more jewellery, or I might just communicate with my business friends about something through Skype. So my day is kind of fragmented, so it's broken into pieces. Um, It's not a nine-to-five job because I have children and I wanted to create a life around my children while they're still young, that I can drop them at school and pick them up and be available to them. And then when they go to bed, I can start working again. 